What's up, guys? We're about to get started with some creepy TikToks. So basically, this guy injects his baby gravy into a pre-chicken, and then he just puts a band-aid on it and waits for a few weeks, and then he cracks it open, and out comes this thing. Yeah. This one is the best. I love that weird worm thing. Unfortunately, weird worm thing spat at Vodka Land Science Man's face, and then in a moment of pure unadulterated Russian rage, he obliterates his half-chicken son with a book that I failed to Google Translate because I don't have a Russian keyboard. After getting spit on, he's not making that same mistake again. He went full Chernobyl suit on us. He stepped up his game. He's doing a full homunculus mukbang up in here. Could you imagine a video collab where this guy works with like one of those food tubers and he cracks open a bunch of homunculi and the other guy just starts shoveling them into his mouth? Moving on. I love how he has his trusty pre-designated homunculus smashing book at the ready in this one. He will not be caught off guard again. Not again. I ain't never experienced nothing like this. So as we driving back to base, I swear I seen a face in the rearview mirror. This creepy video is going viral right now, and it comes from TikTok user Japri. I'll tag him below. And after recently becoming an EMT, him and his partner are driving down the road when he sees a face in the rearview mirror. Feeling creeped out, they quickly pull over, and that's when he begins to record. That is, until he summons up the courage to go back to the ambulance and get the keys so they can get out of there. And this is what happens. Take a look. I'm just curious, like, one, why he, why is he in the alley? Two, where's his partner? He drops his phone in a panic after a loud bang can be heard coming from the back. After a few moments, he grabs his phone, but what happens next is truly terrifying. I don't know if you see it, but can can y'all see that back door? Like it, just, oh shit, like it just flew open. Like can oh, oh. no, nah, what the? Can y'all see it? Nah, hell no. Fuck that. Nah. Go. So, me and my kid just got back from eating dinner, and my bedroom light is on, which is strange because I don't remember leaving it on. Listen, I'm gonna walk inside real fast. I want you to wait out here for me. Yeah, I'm, I'm in, I want you, oh my God. Somebody broke a door. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, Jaden, yeah, it is. Go, go next door, go next door and get your icy, okay? Police, I would even attempt to run in there. You hear me scream? Y'all hear me scream? Call 911. Okay. Okay.
skinwalker caught on camera. Imagine you're me scrolling on your For You page uh, in the middle of the night and you see this. Now, this is a doll. Let's get that out of the way first. And this woman married this doll. There you go. Just picture them at their wedding. And she has like an entire family of like zombie dolls. But is this not so like unnerving? And also, is that not like a child zombie doll? I understand this is not what my like page normally is about. Like it's usually like crime and like hauntings and stuff like that. But like this is freaking me out. I don't know if that's mental health. I'm, I don't understand the context. But that's some wild stuff, brother or miss or I don't know. No disrespect. <laughs> Grooved in the tree. is the true story of the skinwalkers skinwalkers are warlocks with the ability to shapeshift and become animals or people they can not only take your appearance but also clone your voice perfectly the biggest skinwalker sightings have been in ohio and arizona but they are found all over the world the preferred form of skinwalkers is that of your pet they take the form of your pet and enter your home and try to act like your pet to gain your trust and then they can take your life watch how in this video the boy Boy realizes that his dog is a skinwalker. Um, let me see. I'll know if she's my dog. Merlin, sit. Turn around. Turn around. Lay down. You're not my dog. My dog don't know how to do no fucking trick. Uh-uh. The fuck? Call 911. I don't know. Yeah. This doesn't look like fish to me. But look. Look at the I texture. It, my finger makes an indent like a sponge. And then I did this. Squeeze. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. I squeeze it as hard as I could. And look, it gets smaller and smaller and smaller. Do y'all think they've been altering our food and really not telling us or telling us it? A lot of people don't grasp exactly what they're talking about. Tell me what you think. Drop a comment below. Looks like it a wet napkin. Fall apart at all. And then watch this. Be careful with the food you buy. Absorption rate crazy. Oh, Absorbed the water out. and went back I to ran original it under some shape. Water and it reabsorbed everything and it's back to normal. That's not fish. I could be wrong, but I was Ooh. under the impression that ice cream would melt after sitting out all night. Now it looks like somebody shit in my sink that had really bad diarrhea from Taco Bell or maybe White Castle. Look at this shit. Put a magnet that I got from here into the Great Valley Chicken. Um, TikTok? 
I really need your help with this one. Um, I was cooking some spinach and one of the leaves just started inflating and I'm not sure if that's supposed to happen. It kind of looks like plastic. Can somebody tell me what that is? I've never seen this. Is this lab made? What do y'all think TikTok? Could just be all the chemicals that's in the in the animals and stuff. They they change mutations right before our eyes. I don't know. What y'all think? Guys, there is no way that's 80 20. There's no it way. Literally, come on, guys. That's like 50 50. It's just like off to you. I did my grocery order from Walmart, and this is the hamburger they gave us. But you guys, it's not. Y'all remember when hamburger used to have literally the red lines in it like that? Like. It feels like moon sand. Like, what are they doing? Something nobody can explain to this day. Watch the video yourself and see if you get it the first time. I think I see some. Was that a black guy back there at the declaration? He signing? Buddy. That's kind of crazy. The glasses, what's wrong with it? It's a reptilian, I'm not, I'm not, what I'm supposed to be looking at with. All right, let's see what we got. I think that's a black man right there in the back. This video went viral for two reasons, but can you figure it out? Save this video and let me know in the comments if you catch it on the first watch. What did you heard about the Mona Lisa theory. I feel like I've heard theories, of but tell me. Cause There's a theory that the Mona Lisa isn't actually a painting of a woman. It's a painting of a man. Oh, I've heard that. You heard like it's a painting of Leonardo da Vinci's friend and supposed lover. But he kept it a secret. He kept it a time. secret. Yeah. 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 They did like infrared scans of okay. Leonardo's work painting his friend Salai. Right? Okay. That's his friend, supposedly. So they look like twins, basically, but one's a girl, one's a man. So Lai would always dress as a woman, like for fun. For fun. For fun, he would dress as a woman. Mm -hmm. So supposedly, those paintings of Salai before, they look very similar to the Mona Lisa. I'll put it up both. I would say, like, as someone who likes to do art, mm -hmm. that's definitely a believable theory. Right? Because, like, when I, like, I'm exposing myself now. Go, 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 go. I had, like, a crush or something, mm -hmm. like, my pieces, whether it was on purpose or not on purpose, yeah. would look somewhat like my crush. Mm. Or, like, I'd use, like, certain birthmarks or, like, beauty spots. June 23rd of 2023. 
A man named Pablo Dostor was exploring the woods with his dog, when all of a sudden, they see a strange looking building in the distance. Pablo and his dog approach this mysterious building that, for whatever reason, was built in the middle of nowhere. They get really close to the place before suddenly stopping dead in their tracks. Pablo can't explain it, but he can't shake the feeling that something ominous resides within this building. Now the video that Pablo took was actually taken a few days after he came here. He was here before, and the video he took during his initial visit So Pablo been coming multiple times to some place that spooked him. Left him wondering if this place might be haunted or cursed. He wants someone to come home with him. Now it's worth mentioning that not once in any of Pablo's previous explorations has the camera malfunctioned except here. Although it could be a coincidence, the following video has left him convinced that something supernatural resides within this place. On his second visit, something happened that left him pretty spooked. Take a look. Wow. Wow, pequeña espina. Cae la co, cae la. Agua. Tenemos una escalera. Definitivamente se nota que era. Bueno, es muy baja la entrada. Wow. Draco, vení. Bueno, definitivamente no quiere entrar. Es por algo. Vení, Draco. Realmente me siento como bastante acelerado el pulso. Hay una energía definitivamente fuerte. Draco, mm -hmm. vení, el mesito. Vení, entra. Eso. Es un beautiful dog, bro. Ah. No, 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 no. Bueno, me voy acá. Me voy acá. Me voy acá porque no. Me estoy empezando a sentir bien. This abandoned building, which apparently is an old church, has left not only Pablo and Pablo's dog already telling him like, get a get me out of here. I'm getting myself out of here. Unsettled, but his dog as well. Draco, the dog's name, seems hesitant to go inside. Initially, Draco is seen walking about without any problems, but for some reason, the inside of this church scares him. Pablo even states that something about this place doesn't sit well with him. The legend is true, as he states, the church is haunted. Now fast forward to a few days later, and Pablo is back at this place during the nighttime. Draco is also with him, but just like before, something happens that Pablo can't seem to explain. Watch. That night is crazy. Big Poco nervioso, debería decirlo. Vení, Draco, vení, Draco. Por fin subió. Vení. ¿Qué pasa? ¿Por qué no querés estar acá? Vení. ¿Qué hay? 
Drakon. Draco, Vení. So then, could it be that Draco is sensing something frightening or ominous? Or is something else causing him to act this way? Just what exactly was making Draco so... My personal belief, dogs can see things that we just can't. Certain animals can too. It might be just levels to what's around us. It could be things around us and you just don't even know it's there. Afraid. Oh hell no! Are they trying to prepare us for the? And this just start popping up off the ground. Like you know how they say it's great resets and stuff. Life is stuff like this that come off the ground and say, you know what? It's time. <laughs> Sweet tooth type stuff. Is that normal? Somebody let me know down in the comments. I, I don't even know. I don't. That the type of. Hell. What's that? Okay, this is Nico having a temper tantrum, that, getting ready for a show. So I'm curious, what was that? That like a tail? Okay, this is Nico having a temper tantrum, getting ready for a show. And now she just said, Why are you crying? Nico, are you done? And this is what I go through every day. And people think I have a crying baby up here. I will show you. It's really just Nico. <laughs> Nico. 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 You so are call so me, saw you. That a real? Or is that like an artist? Have you seen this video? It appears to show the Duke and Duchess of Sussex looking utterly uncanny. Proof of the paranormal? Not quite. If you notice, the figures behind them are equally uncanny. That's because this was an event to promote Madame Tussauds Wax Museum. The actors are wearing realistic masks. How do I know they're not trying to prepare us, you know? Hey, it's going to be androids that's just like this walking around. You won't be able to tell. And eventually they use actual flesh, human-like flesh, and you won't even know the difference. The royal couple to promote the royal exhibit. But that hasn't stopped the video from making the rounds. it on that video it's my new little series well my continued series the creepy tiktoks um send me videos i'm gonna i got my email in there let me know if you got some creepy stuff out there um as long as it's appropriate i'll show it but like comment and subscribe and uh have a blessed one